Hey guys, it's the holiday season and you might be going out shopping with your family and just looking for great deals and great day gifts for you to give them or for them to give you. But one of my favorite stores is um, a really cool store called It's Sugar and it is a really cool candy store that has candy from around the world. Now, I was walking around, and as my mind usually does, I gravitate towards the Japanese food section, and so I'm just piling it full of Japanese snacks, when lo and behold, what should my little eye spy with my little eye? <sighs> it has come. The Naruto Boruto Mystery Snack Box. It is a partnership between It's Sugar and Asian Food Grocer. And just look at this box art. It is so cute. There are Chibi Boruto and a Chibi Naruto doing a Rasengan together with like magic cookies and snacks all around them. And then on the back is a little Kuruma and a little Naruto's parents, the fourth Hokage. Ah, uh, Kushina. And then here we go. You'll see Hinata and Himawari. And it is just so cute. And there are little snacks all around it. I'm not going to spoil it for you. The box. It is super cute. I love it. And so I figured, let's take a chance. So, spoiler alert for the rest of the video. I will be opening the box and showing you what's inside. If you don't want to ruin the surprise, don't watch anymore. Just go buy it. It is on sale in store for $40 and you can buy it online for $45. Alrighty. Do -do -do -do. Without further ado, I'm super excited. This is supposed to have limited edition snacks that are partnership snacks. So some of these snacks you can get from other places, but some of them you can only get in this box. So, we'll see. We'll see. Is it worth $40? I'm trying not to ruin the box. I think I've already ruined it. <laughs> no, it's so pretty. It's okay, it's just, just the middle logo that's getting messed up. Uh, I should have gotten a knife. <laughs> pretty box. I'm gonna kill myself later. I really like I could have prevented this. I owe a shuriken. I didn't bring them with me. Why didn't I bring my shuriken? <sighs> oh my gosh! Even the candy's cute. And I'm already excited. I'm recognizing some of these candies already. So it looks like we have... Ooh! We've got milk candy crunches. Okay. Fujia Peko Crunch Milk Candy. All right. So we got some milk candy. Nice. What else do we have? Kakudai Koopi Ramoon Candy. Oh, nice. Cool. And it looks like we've got Maruto Nariko Soft Ichigo with wheat cracker. So it's like a build your own kind of ice cream cone foam jelly thing. Nice. Oh, here's one of the limited edition crossover items. It is a Naruto Shippuden Kompeto, Kompeto candy. And they're basically just little sugars that have a little bit of food coloring and sometimes have a little bit of flavor. It looks like these are pineapple flavored. And as you can see, there are little chibi characters all over the bag. I can't wait to try it. I'm gonna try all of these with you guys. So I'll let you know how they all taste. And then it looks like we have seasoned almonds. Sanko Maruto Almond Kokuto. So it looks like it's almonds and then there's like some almond paste and then it's covered in I think chocolate. So I'm excited. More stuff to be excited about. No way! 
We got shredded squid. Ha! We got shredded squid, guys. We're getting a full experience here. Oh, these are those jelly cubes. Yes, I know what these are. Okay, so here's little sugar jelly cubes. A nice variety of colors. Oh, they threw in some strange Kit Kats. Oh, these are Yuzu Matcha Kit Kats. Yes, so instead of a whole bag, it looks like we get three, unless I dig more out in a minute, it looks like we get three Yuzu Matcha Kit Kats. Let's see, take a look at that. And then we've got two more bags of those little square jelly candies, so three total. And then we have Boruto Biscuits. These are a wheat, wheat flour biscuit. Okay. Okay. It's a resealable bag, part of the Naruto 20th anniversary. <coughs> Very nice. I'm excited. Alrighty. Here's another limited item. Choji approved scrambled egg potato chips. And oh my gosh, there are chibi characters all over the bag. And there is a little Shikamaru and little, you know, on the back. And Choji's on front, of course, because he gives his seal of approval for these chips, so they're, they're gonna be good. All right, looks like we had a little rice cracker snack. That got a little broken, but. Oh, there was a second one that got very broken. I don't know why they packed it like this, but it was right next to the Ramoon sodas. And this has two special Ramoon sodas in it. Um, and they're different characters that you can get. So it looks like the one I got. I got a uh, Grape Mizuki Ramoon soda. And then I also got, oh yeah, I got a Raspberry Itachi Ramoon soda. And there are all the different ones that you can collect. Apparently, there's all different characters and all different flavors. So, we're gonna stick those right here. We'll stick those in the fridge. Alrighty, what do we got in here? Oh, okay. Kyoshin Candy Soda Box. Okay. So, they're all different flavors. So, it looks like there's a yogurt drink. An ice cream soda, a Ramoon soda, and a strawberry soda. And then you take, it comes with a little toothpick pick that you stab and you can eat them out of the box. I'm excited to try these. These look so good. All right. Oh, so there are more Kit Kats. So they gave us six Yuzu Matcha Kit Kats. And then finally, Last thing in this box is an Ito Raguri Uji Matcha Yokuro Iri. So it's wheat crackers with a matcha filling, is what this is. But all the ingredients seem mostly natural, which is nice. I'm excited. Okay. So, all right, now I'm gonna show you what's all in the box. Okay, so here you're seeing the box and all the yummy snacks that come inside. There's so many yummy things. I'm so happy to share it with you guys. Yay! Okay, so that's everything that come came in my box. Apparently, other than the limited edition collab items, which are the Boruto biscuits, the um, egg chips, and the Competo and the Ramoon sodas. There are other items. The other items uh, will be different. You will always get a type of Kit Kat and you will always get, um, it looks like a type of cookie or biscuit extra in your box as well. Apparently you can also get packs of snack cakes. You can get all kinds of different do DIY kits. Apparently, it, it, they, the boxes are different with the other things you get, but you will always get a type of Kit Kat, the um, three 
crossover snacks and two random character random flavors of Ramon sodas so I'm super happy and super excited to try these with you guys so we're definitely going to try the crossover items first um the other items I feel like um are just normal uh regular items from the Asian grocery mart but it seems like a pretty good value so far but let's taste the crossover items and see if they're good let's start with the 20th anniversary Boruto biscuits. Let's see if these are good. They're in a resealable bag, which I greatly appreciate. Makes my life easier if I don't want to eat a whole bag. Oh my god! No way! They're shaped like the characters' faces! Oh my god! They're so cute! It's a little Sara Duck cracker. It's kind of hard to see, but I don't know if you can tell. It's a little Sara Duck. I eat Sara Duck, sorry. Okay, they just taste like a normal butter cracker. They're sweet and salty. They're pretty good. I don't know who that is. Who is this? Is that? Oh, it's Bolt, but it's like. Okay, they could they couldn't do his hair like it's normally drawn because of the limitations of cracker art, I guess. I think this is Boruto. I might be wrong. You'll have to correct me if I am. Sorry, it's really hard to see. Hard to see in person. It's not showing up on the camera very well, sorry. Let's see if I can find a different character. Oh no, sorry. Da. Are there a Mizuki in here? Who is this? That's oh, someone different. Oh, there's Mizuki. Okay, so it's it's these three characters. It's Boruto, Sarada, and Mizuki. Crackers. Cool. And they're just Ritz crackers, so I'm not gonna... Well, they taste like Ritz, if you know what Ritz are. They're just butter crackers. They're really good. Okay, thank you. So, that's good. Alright, I'm excited. Mmm. Okay. I was trying to try these Choji approved Nardo Shippuden scrambled egg potato chips. I don't know about these guys. We'll find out together. This bag does not want to open. This bag is Choji approved. They really don't want these chips breaking. Color me surprised and impressed. Nice, good, whole potato chip. Mmm. Okay, these are good. Okay. Okay, these are good. It's not super eggy. They have like a nice light egg flavor. It's a slight sweetness, but it's really nice. Mm. Okay, I'm gonna like eat this whole bag. Oh my god, these are good. I'm gonna stop because I need to try the rest of the stuff, but these are really good. Wow. Well, yeah, no wonder Choji's like these. These do contain egg and milk, though, so if you're a vegan, you probably won't be able to eat these. But if you're just a vegetarian and you're okay with eggs, it should be fine. Mm. Okay. Those are really good. <laughs> All right. Um, I've had Competo before. The flavoring is really light on Competo usually, if they are flavored. Competo is just like an ancient Japanese like sugar candy. It's usually star shaped. It's supposed to be good luck. Mm. 
Dash good.